I am Sally. Welcome again to Fun and Diary. This time I made a red dragon cake topper. I needed more time to make this dragon and also for video editing. So I hope you watch this video until the end. Let's get started. First, I will make two wire frames for the two dragon wings. Prepare a strong but bendable wire with a thickness of 1.5 mm to 2 mm. Two pieces are 60 cm long and two pieces are 45 cm long. Then wrap the four wires with paper tape for flower wire. Then prepare another egg pieces of wire with a length of 26 cm. Take one piece of 60 cm wire, join the 60 cm wire with one piece of 45 cm wire at one end, and at the other end, join it with four pieces of 26 cm wire. Then at the meeting of the three wires, tie it with floral wire. Then with the flower wire again, tie the wing bones so they don't move easily. Then wrap the wire again. And do it again for the other wing in the same way. And next, join the two wings at a distance of 7.5 cm after the connection. And if your wire are too hard to bend by hands, you can use pliers to bend them. And make a loop of wire up to 4 cm. And make the distance for the legs by 5 cm. And bend the legs forward. And bend back at 4.5 cm. And bend forward again at a distance of 2 cm. Then bend it again with a distance of 2 cm to mark the ends of the legs. Then open the legs and stick the two wires straight down until the end marks of the legs. And next, prepare two pieces of wire that are 50 cm long. And for both wires, wrap half the length of the wire or 25 cm with paper tape. Then combine and wrap them both on the unwrapped part with paper tape.
then tie it to the body frame. Then bend the wire for the head part at a distance of 15 cm from the body. And still for the head part, prepare one wire that is 22 cm long and wrap it with paper tape. And bend the wire at a distance of 7.5 cm. Then join and tie the wires together to form the mouth. And next prepare 4 flower wires to make the dragon hair. And next, I use aluminum foil for the body. Then bend the wings in the middle. Then on each wing, I cut the bottom wire 3 cm long and I cut 2 cm for the second wire from the bottom. After we've created the dragon frame or skeleton, next we're going to cover the frame with fondant. And to make the skin color, I mix yellow egg yolk, pink, and brown color. 
Then I take some and mix it with CMC or Tylos powder. Then I wet the frame with water. Then I will shape and attach the fondant to the frame. I listed the weight for each fondant in the upper left corner of the screen.
and next we will create the wings.
So this is my dragon before it was colored. Before the coloring process, dry this dragon topper first until it is dry and harden overnight. For the coloring, I use oil or gel based food coloring which I usually use to color my fondant. And for the diluent or solvent, I only use water or if you usually use vodka, you can use it. For the color of the inside of the mouth, I mix red and brown. And for the color of the tongue, I mix red, pink, and white. And in the middle of the tongue, I draw a white line. For the sides of the mouth, I use orange mixed with brown. And next, for the dragon's entire body, I use yellow egg yolk color as the base color. Later, I will add with orange color. And lastly, I will add it with red color. So the lightest color is given first, then followed by the darker color. When coloring, I also brush it with water to give color gradation. And next, I brush it with orange color. And next is red color. Sorry, there is a slight change in color brightness on the screen because I changed the camera due to full memory. As you can see, after I brush it with red, I brush it again with water to soften the color and form a color gradation.
and I use brown color for the dragon legs. And next, I will use black color. And then, red again. And then black again. Then red again, then black again for the eyes. And lastly, the white color for the dragon's teeth. And also white color to make small dots on the body and wings. So here it is, a red dragon cake topper for a dragon team cake. What do you think? Thank you for watching. Until the end of this video, don't forget to hit the like button and leave a comment if you like this tutorial. And also thank you to the members who have supported my channel. I have listed the names of the members at the end of this video. See you again in my next video. Bye!